Hi friends, welcome to TurboMath channel. In this video, we are going to solve three questions about PEMDAS rule. In the first question, we have open parentheses 14 plus 39 close parentheses then over 13 times 4 to the power of 2 minus 10 divided by 2. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have parentheses addition, multiplication, exponent, subtraction, and division. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. Okay guys, in this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside these parentheses, we have 14 plus 39, which equals 53. Now we have 53 over 13, then times 4 to the power of 2, minus 10, divided by 2. Okay, guys. In this step, we have multiplication, exponent, subtraction, and division. First, we simplify this exponent. 4 to the power of 2 equals 16. 53 over 13 times 16 minus 10 divided by 2. Now we have multiplication, subtraction, and division. In this step, we simplify this multiplication. 53 over 13 times 16 equals 848 over 13. Now the question is 848 over 13 minus 10, then divided by 2. In this step, we have subtraction and division. First, we simplify this division, because division has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 10 divided by 2 equals negative 5. Now we have 848 over 13 minus 5. Since the denominator of this fraction is 13, we can write 5 as 65 over 13. Now we have 848 over 13 minus 65 over 13. Okay guys, 848 over 13 minus 65 over 13 equals 783 over 13. The final answer of this question equals 783 over 13. Okay guys, let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule. In this question, we have negative 5 plus 5 times negative 6 plus 6, then times 4. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have addition and multiplication. Some people solve this question like this. Negative 5 plus 5 equals 0. 0 times negative 6 plus 6, which equals 0, then times 4. 0 times 0 equals 0, and 0 times 4 equals 0. They say the final answer of this question equals 0. But this answer is wrong. Again, some people solve this question like this. Negative 5 plus 5 equals 0. 0 times negative 6 plus 6, then times 4. 0 times negative 6 equals 0. 0 plus 6, then times 4. 0 plus 6 equals 6, and 6 times 4 equals 24. They say the final answer of this question equals 24. But this answer is definitely wrong. Let's solve this question step by step together. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify this multiplication. 5 times negative 6 equals negative 30. Now we have negative 5 minus 30 plus 6, then times 4. Okay guys, now we have subtraction, addition, and multiplication. In this step, we simplify this multiplication. 6 times 4 equals 24. Now the question is, negative 5 minus 30, then plus 24. Negative 5 minus 30 equals negative 35. Now the question is negative 35 plus 24. Negative 35 plus 24 equals negative 11. 
The final answer of this question equals negative 11. Guys, if you want to get the right answer of this question, you must follow the PEMDAS rule. And if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. Let's solve another question. 7 plus open parentheses, 6 plus 6 close parentheses, divided by 6, then times open parentheses, 6 plus 6 close parentheses. What is the answer of this question? We have addition, parentheses, division, and multiplication. Again, to solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations. If you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. As you know, in this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority. Addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside these parentheses, we have 6 plus 6. 6 plus 6 equals 12. Now we have 7 plus 12 divided by 6, then times open parentheses, 6 plus 6 close parentheses. Okay guys, now we have addition, division, multiplication, and parentheses. Again, we simplify these parentheses. 6 plus 6 equals 12. Now the question is 7 plus 12 divided by 6, then times 12. In this step, we have addition, division, and multiplication. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify this division. 12 divided by 6 equals 2. Now the question is 7 plus 2 then times 12. Okay guys, now we have addition and multiplication. In this step, we simplify this multiplication because the multiplication has higher priority than addition. 2 times 12 equals 24. Now the question is 7 plus 24. 7 plus 24 equals 31. The final answer of this question equals 31. Guys, if you don't pay attention to the PEMDAS rule, you get the wrong answer. If you want to get the right answer of this question, you must follow the PEMDAS rule. Okay guys, now tell me in the comments what is the answer of this question. 4 plus open parentheses, 33 plus 3 close parentheses divided by 3, then times open parentheses, 33 plus 3 close parentheses. Can you solve this question? Please tell me in the comments what is the answer of this question. Thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe to the channel and leave a comment. Goodbye.